Hey everyone, I'm Jason Portwando. It's been dubbed the most exciting two minutes in sports. This year's Kentucky Derby is right around the corner and it's inspired me to give you my top five from the last 10 years under the Twin Spires. The Candome begins in 2012. It was a year of first, literally. I'll have another. A $35,000 purchase would give jockey Mario Uterez and trainer Doug O'Neill their initial derby wins. And he was also the first, and to this day, only horse to win from post-19. Here's the wire. I'll have another. And won the Kentucky Derby. Hall of Fame trainer Shug McGahee has tasted a lot of success in big time races, but the Derby wasn't on that list until 2013. The Kentucky native would watch his horse Orb weave through traffic in the goo under jockey Joel Rosario, grabbing the victory and my four spot. As they come down to the 16th pole, it is Orb in front, down to the wire. Orb has won the Kentucky Derby. At number three, it's a horse that became the first cowbred in 52 years and just fourth overall to win the Kentucky Derby. Uh, in the process, California Chrome, the favorite, prevailed and made trainer Art Sherman the oldest ever to win a derby at age 77. California Chrome into the final furlong. California Chrome shines bright in the Kentucky Derby. The runner-up in my top five features a stretch-long battle, which eventually went to the crowd favorite, a homebred by the name of American Pharaoh. That crowd, by the way, a record 170,513, somehow squeezing their way into the Louisville racetrack to watch Bob Baffert get his fourth. It's American Pharaoh in front, firing line. Dortmund is third, Frost in his fourth, coming to the finish. American Pharaoh and Victor Espinosa have won the Kentucky Derby. Number one on my list goes to a superstar that somehow ended the curse of Apollo, which dated all the way back to 1882. He was the last horse to win the Derby, despite missing out on his juvenile campaign. Then along came Justify. He was up on that hot pace, 22 and one, 45 and three, 111 flat over the slop, and somehow still had enough gas left to fuel a performance for the ages. They're coming to the wire. He's just awesome. Justify has won the Kentucky Derby. Hard to believe that's the only time Hall of Famers Mike Smith and Bob Baffert combined to win a Kentucky Derby. Justify would go on to become the 13th and most recent U.S. Triple Crown winner. That's a look at my Kentucky Derby top five moments. Hopefully you enjoy this year's race. I'm Jason Portwine.